a nice, simple and easy to understand Bitcoin technical analysis for you, explaining why I remain bullish on Bitcoin. I am expecting higher targets to be hit and I am taking no short trades here. So it's the same bias that I've had for the past few weeks, ever since we breached that major level that I had of 27500 flipping that into support, moving on through $30,000, flipping that into support, and now the $33,000, flipping it into support. For me, I'm keeping it very simple. While we are flipping these resistances into supports, we are seeing big signs of strength on the charts. I am remaining looking for higher prices. I will now explain the higher prices next that I'm looking for, because one thing I want to make very clear, although I am bullish, although I am not shorting yet, and I am expecting higher prices to come, that doesn't mean we're just going to let FOMO take over and get ultra, expe ultra excited, you know, these $100,000 is coming, all time highs are guaranteed, buy, buy, buy. No, I'm going to do remain calm and collected, trading level to level as I teach and do religiously when it comes to the charts. So where is the next level that I'm looking at? I've already mentioned it a few videos ago, but I'm going to mention it again just to, you know, re sometimes repeating the information can be very helpful for some people. And that is the next level that I have above me is this lovely NPOC sitting on that lovely big 382 Fibonacci level with the $37,000 just above on the daily. So we have this next nice, lovely resistance zone right above us on price, okay? From that NPC to the higher NPC. That is a weekly, this is a daily, okay? So for me, I am bullish. I am not shorting yet. That is because I got my next target above me. If I get a lovely bearish reaction at that target, then of course I will take a short trade. Alternatively, we blast straight through that resistance, just as we did here on 32 and a half, 33. We actually blasted straight through a level that I was keen on shorting while we were trading at 27K. You know, I had my eyes on 32 and a half, 33,000 dollars. And what did we do? We actually went straight through that resistance and back tested it as support. So naturally, there was no short trade to be had, actually gave a long trade opportunity. So the same theory I'm looking for now. Interested in the short just above us on these NPOCs. Though, if we do what we've done prior and we blast straight through the level, then naturally there's going to be no short trade for me. Could even end in a long and I will continue looking up for that forty, fifty thousand dollars $50,000 higher targets. But for me, I repeat one more time, I am a level to level trader. I've been making it clear for weeks now, and I repeat exactly what I'm telling everybody in my group as the for the champion members, right? And that is long and chill for higher prices to come on Bitcoin. I remain with my bullish bias. I'm explaining it to the members. I'm telling you here in the public, um, you know, if you want to know whether I'm taking a short here, if and when we hit that level in real time, then this is what you get in the Champions membership. You get much more detailed analysis. You get daily live streams. You get live trading streams. You have the content of educational library. And you have, of course, have these Discord posts. So you don't need to be waiting for even a video. Uh, so if you would like all of that, you can, of course, take advantage of it over at chartchampions.com. We can take a advantage two of the latest exchange deals that we have a lot of people have been facing restrictions with kyc so the latest exchange that we're looking at which has no kyc has stock trading forex trading cryptocurrency trading you know all the indexes such as es you can trade all of that in one place on bing x so this is a good option for your usa uk canada etc who are you know having issues right now bing x is no kyc you got access to all of those uh you know different cryptocurrencies as well as the stock market. It's a pretty cool option. So I'm currently using Bing X and Bybit. Of course, we always recommend this with a VPN. So uh, yeah, if you'd like to get the best deals possible for Bybit and Bing X, you can get that over on the deals page on the Chart Champions website. And if you want to take advantage of the educational courses, the competitions, the journals, the cheat sheets, the templates, the, everything that you need basically to trade successfully, you can get that via the main Champions and Contenders membership. For me, I'm just repeating one more time. I want it to be very clear to everybody. I am not shorting here. I will not short in this range. I am waiting for higher. I have high confidence in my target to be hit. I'm monitoring the order flow. I'm looking every day, every hour like at the charts. I'm studying them. I'm not going to get carried away. I'm not going to get overconfident and let my analysis, you know, fall down here. I'm going to stay focused. I'm going to remain calm. I'm going to remain collected. And that is 
higher prices to come. I'll wait for the reaction at my next target. If I don't get a bearish reaction, I'll continue to look for even higher to 40, 50k. If I do get a bearish reaction, well, hey, I'm going to lock in that short trade and I'll take it. If you'd like to know how, you know, once you've took that trade, the targets, etc., how to go more into detail, well, that will be in a later video, but I've already given that information to the champions. We've already got the full trade set up, you know, planned out and exactly how we're going to do that. So yeah, massive few months ahead to end 2023. If you want to be on the winning team, you know where to be, Chart Champions. I'm going to wrap it there. Hope this has been helpful. If it has, you know what to do. Hit the like, hit the comments down below. I read them all and I hope you have a brilliant week ahead. Let's absolutely crush it, champs. Cheers. Thank you. And that's me signing out. Goodbye.